Guy in the wheelchair is so distracting because you just want to mock him. Wait, is that his girlfriend? Wait, what? How does that work? Bro, these coppers are looking at this little fella in the wheelchair and going, Oh my god, man, this is going to be so much paperwork. Oh, it's still hey, going. Hey, relax. What the f hey, oh, relax, bro. Are you laughing at me, bro? We're not laughing what at you. What the f you bro? Really good palate cleanser here, guys. Let's uh, let's get into this. <laughs> What's this? Two migrants have died trying to cross the English Channel. Oh, oh boy. Oops. No, it's not that really. It's not that. <laughs> it's not that really. All right. I'm only messing around. I love migrants. Refugees, welcome here. No, it's actually this. Do you remember? The other day, I, f I found someone shared that clip on Twitter of that guy in a wheelchair and he was like arguing with the police, okay? Well, guess what? Someone shared the full body cam footage and we're going to watch that as a palate cleanser, okay? What's going on, man? How can I help you? Okay. Uh, so these are uh, her and her mom are my kids. They come to help provide services for me. Okay. Uh, I'm sitting in the office today working here and I work from home. Okay. And uh, my yeah. mother and her and her mother started having a, a verbal dispute. I hear all this commotion, I hear all this screaming. I'm in the middle of work, so I, I took a break, I come outside, see what's going on. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just told everybody to be quiet, tell me what's going on. This the situation is that uh, they have keys to come into the house to provide services to me. Yeah. And I provide it to them. Mm -hmm. She, uh, she, when I say my, she is my mother, uh, was upset because they were coming in and out to provide services. Cool. Okay, <clears throat> I know it's easy to just laugh at the guy in the wheelchair. I'm going to not do that, and I just actually want to try and figure out what I think about this situation. The guy in the wheelchair is so distracting because you just want to mock him. <laughs> but, like, there's probably, you do need to be fair in this and actually figure out what's going on, right? But I, I, it is quite distracting. Some little, some little fella sat there, and I'm like, okay, well, some little wretched guy. Oh, no, let's be fair and see what's going on. <laughs> she, my mom, is in seventh grade. Okay, that's wonderful. Do you know if she Whatever. gave them any orders or something? I'm surprised nobody's brought up Mr. Beast has a felony. Granted, it's felony speeding, but still feels like something to bring up. Thank you for the five pound. I mean, I don't know, dude. I just, I feel that's the Mr. Beast arrangement thing where it's like anything we can think. Oh, he's got a speeding felony. I don't really care about that. I think he listen, don't come during this time or just give it. Thank you know, like the five pound though. She cannot, number one, because uh, it's my services. She has no authority to make decisions about my medical services. Number one. So you're, um, she hasn't, she's not the one that's. Because you know how sometimes when, when individuals, no, yeah, like caregivers not. and stuff like that, no. she's not listed because like with of, the... Because of the last altercation that had happened yeah. last year, she was removed. Did the courts well. deem you as capable of, she's of never making had, decisions like, custody. and stuff? She's no, it's not custody. It's like, you know how the courts sometimes will do that just to make sure that the, the best interests of the individual with the disability yeah, or injuries come, or stuff? Yeah, okay. it's never come to that. Yeah, you know, I'm just making sure. That's yeah. that, that's one of the things that I just want to yeah, make it's sure. It's never come to that point. And okay. because I'm going to die, I can make my own decisions. Yeah, but no, I you know what I'm saying, man. Um, I just tell everybody, shut up, what's going on? She, she okay. sent me. Um, her and her mom uh, work different shifts. So she works Monday through Friday. That's your grandmother? No, no. They're not related to me at all. <laughs> Her and her mom, this lady? Yeah. Oh, okay, and then your mom. Okay, Correct. nine. Her and her mom work at the finishers. She works at uh, Monday through Friday, and then the lady works the week. Okay. When one has to do something, they cover comes. for each other. Yeah, exactly. Okay. It's a teamwork. She was in agreement that that, that, that that was happening. So I told her, Mom, you have nothing to do with this. You're not involved. Do they live with, with you 24 hours? Yeah. They work the schedule of Monday to Friday, 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. And at night, who cares for you? My mother. Maybe you um, want to consider having them care for you 24 hours? It's been a battle I've had with the insurance. It's not that much insurance to pay for the 24 hours. But that's the dilemma I'm in because I'm mentally capable of making my own decisions. They don't approve 24 hours. So that's like the predicament that I'm in. You know what I'm saying? Well, I think also because you have your, your mother lives with you, so you're showing I the capability. No, but she's living with you, right? So that's I, the thing. That's probably one of Right, so from what I understand, this guy wants to be more independent, but his mother is like not letting him be independent because he's a little fella in a wheelchair. 
Is that correct? Am I understanding this correctly? The things where they're like, look, you have the ability to have somebody come in that's no, not them to take care of you. When, I, when everything happened back in, in September when we guys took over the first time, yeah. I had moved out and I requested 24 hours and we still did not. So it's not because of that. Uh, regardless. So whatever, she and I started our arguing. Mm -hmm. She tried to slide me. I, I moved back and mm -hmm. she, she, she didn't hit me at all. She just like kind of grazed me with the, with the nail. Yeah, that's still touching though. Um, but whatever, I don't, I don't want to push charges, I don't want to... The want thing is that, un unfortunately, once once certain things are said and done, and... So I came is, out... I we came don't have out. any discretion on domestics, you understand? So, just it is what it is. So. I came out to try and, and avoid the situations. Mm -hmm. And, you know, all I need to understand is that she has to let the aides come in. Because if yeah. she doesn't want to help me, I mean, she can't because of her age. Yeah. So what do you want me to do as a supervisor? Because they said you needed a supervisor. If you could just speak to her and just explain to her. Yeah. Yeah. These officers are capable of doing that. You don't have to call us every single time. Well, like she's the one that called. I didn't call. Oh, she requested yeah. a supervisor. I didn't you. call. She's the one. She's the one that made the original call. Maybe. No, it shows you. You're no. Bryant. I made a second call. Oh, okay. She's That's the what's showing on there. Call. Yeah. She's the one requesting a supervisor? No, I requested a supervisor just for a standard procedure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this new Mr. Beast challenge looks pretty crazy. I wonder what's going to happen next. If, don't we, you really don't need to call a supervisor unless it's... Some... By the way, guys, listen, if you've got any more Mr. Beast stuff, I'll look at it. But I just, dude, there's nothing... It's, we're, I'm, you're sucking on a dry titty at this point, okay? It's fucking done. I think that, like, you see that is not being done properly by the officers or something that is to your concern. Um, but usually... The majority of all the officers that we have out here, they, especially when it comes to domestics, they don't have any discretion, unfortunately, and they have to take action. A lot of times, it just if someone is what has it to is. go, I'll go. You can't go because you already gave certain statements, so we're not gonna take you. When is Slander Hall making his response video? Well, he's West Side Tyler is giving him a bunch of new ammo with this new expose, so. I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see what he pulls out of the bag. Because you're the one that was the victim of the battery, so... But, you know, she's a witness too, so she's she's writing a statement. Do you want to write a statement as well, or, or have some have her write it down? Oh, cool, I'll go over there, Brian. He can come. Put that in. Yeah, I don't want you in the street, because these people drive like... No, it's okay. No, they drive like the cameras. Oh, it's okay. Oh, that's fine. Um, yeah, does she, she go yeah, she, she was big character. I think it was the big character. I don't know. Um, so after she got arrested, two weeks later, she tried to commit suicide. She took a bottle of tires. So that's why I don't want that to happen again, because I know she's going to pull another stuff. And what happened? What is the change in behavior today? And what has she been? Has she been diagnosed with uh, any mental So when they big character her, that they gave her a discharge, obviously they discharged her to me. Okay. And she was supposed to follow up to a psychiatrist, but I haven't been able to get her to go because she doesn't want to go. So she's and refusing to go seek she's treatment? Going, she's refusing to seek What about the meds? What did they send her? Do you know what they sent her? Do you know what it was di what she was diagnosed Major with? Major depression and uh, bipolar. Bipolar? And today, on today's date, or since she's been released from Baker Act, has she made any threats to harm or hurt herself? Or she always does. Or others? Like, like, like on, on, she, she, she plays a lot the victim, okay. the victim uh, card. Okay. Um, due to everything that, ha that happened last time when she got arrested, uh, my relationship with my brothers hasn't been the best due to, to her. Okay. Um, but when everything happened, a lot of things have come out light okay. that I didn't know of, obviously, because I've always been under her okay. her wings, basically. Um, and apparently there was, there's was there been a lot of trauma the, the whole life, especially dealing with me, with my situation, yeah. and all that. Um, I'm sure it's challenging at times, it there's is. better days it than is. others. It is, it is, but you know, like, I'm I'm really the only support that she has, okay. like, financially. I'm the only support that she has, like, financially. So, just like she's, she's supported me all my life, I've, within my capabilities, yeah. I've tried to do the best that I can, too. Mm -hmm. But yeah. she, uh, nothing is ever enough for her, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, I, mean, I really would not like it, and I, I hope you understand, really would not like that you take her. Um, I'm willing like to go. No, just allow me uh... to, no, not go. I mean, like, leave the house. I mean, <laughs> okay, so, open, no, just chill out with that. Um, did the other officers talk to her prior to our arrival? Yeah. 
The CRU officer spoke to her? Yeah. And what did they explain to you? Um, no, they? Well, they, no, they just... That she was, so she was in her right mind, but... That she was in her right state of mind? They, I guess, went to go speak to her and try to ask her all the other yeah, questions. Um, and they called us because Was it disclosed that he, that she tried to slap him or whatever? I don't know. Did they know that at that time? Yeah. They, they did? did? Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, let us discuss this a little further, and then uh, we'll get back to you guys. Oh, like I said, please. I really like that you don't take it. No, no. We're just gonna. We're we're I'm we're looking at the options that we have. I'm, I'm willing to. Okay. So just to break it down, then. So basically, this guy's mother wants to control him because he's in a wheelchair. He wants more independence. They got in some sort of argument, and she sh tried to hit him with some sort of thing with a nail in. Is that right? But missed. And the cops trying to figure out what's going on. Anyway, guys, trust me. Keep watching. It gets fucking <laughs> with the clip I've seen. Okay, it gets good. All right. If someone just goes in, yeah. so she could go in. I could get some clothes and leave for a couple of days. I could go to my girlfriend's house for a couple of days and just let things cool off. And I'll just, just go wait over there. I'm gonna talk to him about it. This is a very common thing amongst disabled. Okay, they want all the independence, and I get that. And I think some people probably can be independent. I think there is also obviously. Uh, a sort of overconfidence, right? Where there probably does need to be some sort of care because, or some sort of backup. Wait, is that his girlfriend? Wait, what? How does that work? And so she could go in, I could get some clothes and leave for a couple of days. I can go to my girlfriend's house for a couple of days and just let things cool off. And no, just, just go wait over there. I'm going to talk to him about it and we'll keep you informed. <laughs> Look at that little movement. Look. Cool off and no, just just that? go wait over there. I'm going to talk to him about it and we'll keep you informed. Mm, get it all, Thanks. Get it all, oh, we get to see the mother as well. Okay, good. We're getting to see both sides of it. Let's go. Let's just say I'm hoping that little taser there sees some use. We'll find out. Oh. She's getting put in cuffs. Oh, I think you missed the point where he lives with his mom. That seems a bit off a rocker and he has no option but to do that because he doesn't get 24 hours. Oh, sorry, my bad. Okay. So we, but right, I fucked that explanation up. I got distracted. So basically he wants out because she's a nutter, but he's, it's difficult because he can't get the care that he maybe needs. Okay, I fucked it up. My bad. Okay. Okay. So she's getting put in cuffs. Okay, guys, can we be real about something for a second, okay? Oh my God, dude. Looking after someone who has got some sort of insane disability is very stressful, okay? So I'm not going to advocate for it. I don't think it's a good thing, but I can at least have some sympathy for someone just, you know, getting a bit resentful and maybe at least thinking about slapping someone about a little bit, okay? <clears throat> I don't agree with it. I don't think it's good. I don't think you should do it. But I can at least understand it's like, oh to look after you all the fucking time. This is fucking so annoying. I can't live my life. Just a little fucking, you know. One enter, radioactive, became a member, nuke clear W1 enter, radioactive, celebrates five months of membership. He went on Pipo Riveter's channel claiming he didn't spit hey? away the cop Did with he? his chair and they arrested him for nothing. Did he really? He went on old tipsters channel. That's crazy. Thank you for the membership. What do they say in English? In English, please. You have two cups or no? Yeah, when I get on the car, when I get over there, I'll... Just wait over there, bro. Hey, stop 
hitting me with no, the chair, man, Brian. Stop doing That's a that. battery on our Oh my god, he's 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 rolled himself up. He's <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Wait, I missed that. You have two cuffs or no? Wait. They see me rolling. They hating. Just wait over there, Brian. 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 No. Hey, stop hitting me with the no, chair, Brian. That's a battery on our wheel. You just said. That's a battery on our wheel, bro. Bro, you guys just said you weren't going to do that. Bro. What the we said we're going to go talk to her. Well, what are you going to do about it? Calm down. Or what are you going to do about it? No. What do this and other stories we cover make clear? That it is so important to know who you're surrounding yourself with, right? Well, that is why I am thrilled to talk about our sponsor of our body cam videos, truthfinder.com. What do you hear about this? Because honestly, with our content, I really can't think of a better service that can provide actual I don't skip the ads. I'm not, a, listen, I'm not so a scumfuck, Truthfinder okay? is one of the largest the public record search services in the entire world. Their goal is to help people like you learn the facts about the people in their lives. Here's how it works. Dude, it is like what? It's probably less, it's probably a minute, and you guys can't even. You complaining about it and saying to skip it is making this longer. You're only extending the pain. You guys, you have, your dopamine receptors are so fucking fried that you can't sit there for a minute. You fucking lost it, dude. How do you cope going to the cinema at the start when they play trailers and, and fucking before that they play the adverts? Holy fuck, dude! I hope this streaming services. Put adverts in and you can't skip them just to piss you off. You go on their website, truthfinder.com, and you type in a name. For instance, your new neighbor. Let's say your neighbor is me, Jesse Weber. So you type in my name, and within minutes, you get access to reports that include information like phone numbers, addresses, associates, previous arrests, criminal convictions. You get all that. But you know what's really, really useful? If you type in an address, it tells you the registered sex offenders that may live in that area, too. Wait, what? What? I think we watched this before, didn't we? And that's the point. Unless you use Truthfinder. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it shows you all the Mr. Beast employees in your local area. Sex offenders that may live in that area, too. Okay, and that's the point. Unless you use Truthfinder, oh, you point. may never know the reality about the people around you. Also, if you're in the online dating world, how scary can that be? Just going out with complete strangers. It's just genuinely a good idea to run a background check on potential dates before meeting them in person. And can easily do that on Truthfinder. So, right now, you can get 50, 50 percent. See? You watch the advert, you get a little slice of uh, content out of it, a little, a little, a little scrap of content. Off of confidential background reports, just go to truthfinder.com slash LC body cam. Okay. All right, so take me then. If you want to take me, then take me. I just told you not to do that. Then I'll get to leave the house. You can't do that, man. Once there's a battery, we have no Bro, I just battery. told you she didn't hit me. She's, her nail grazed me, that's all. Oh, the nail thing. Right. So she made some sort of movement towards him and, and scratched him with a nail. And now he's upset because he feels she's getting harsher treatment than is legitimate. That's all she did. All right, so take, take me. Don't hit me, bro. So just take me then. Don't hit me. If she's going, I'm going. Brian, don't hit me. If man. she's going, I'm, I'm going. Telling you right now. If she's going, I'm going. Calm down. Yeah. Bro, these coppers are looking at this little fella in the wheelchair and going, oh my God, man, this can be so much paperwork. Do you know how much paperwork a crippled suspect takes? Holy fuck, dude. No, thank you. Hey. Take stop, me. man. Get my hands. Stop. Take me. No. Shut up. You shut the fuck up. I'm going. Yeah, Take me. Uh, let me okay. Listen, unfortunately, the way that laws are written. Fuck, it, fuck pigs, bro. We, we just have a conversation. This, and you tell me one thing, and you go to f another stunt. Either she was going to be Baker acted or she was going to be. Alright, so Baker actor. So a Baker actor. You cannot Baker act on a domestic violence case. What the f are you talking about? She was Baker acted last time. But that was some other issue. Alright, so take me. So I'm taking. I'm going. Las llaves están ahí. Dale, señora, métase. Wow, why are you? Hey, hey, relax. Why the f*** are 
Hey, relax, bro. Are you f***ing laughing at me, bro? We're not laughing at you. What the f*** is wrong with you, bro? Hey, what the f*** is wrong with you? Why the f*** you locking me out of my house? We're gonna expend it to you right now. Go over there and we'll see you. That is classic little man syndrome, buffed by disa being disabled. You laughing at me, bro? You laughing at me? In this little wheelchair. What the f you doing about it? What the f you doing about it, bro? Déjame ir contigo. No, siéntese, señora. Mira, señora, por favor. Ay, no, está un bebé. Al lado hay unas cajas y hay un bolsito ahí. Bro, ¿qué es tu problema? Get in the car. Métate adentro del carro, señora. Just take me. Oh, you're going. Okay. You're fing going. You're under arrest for battery on a Leo. Okay. Oh, shit. Eso no es lo que quería. No está brujería. O sea, de hecho. Yo estoy con otro caso de reference battery on a Leo. One three nine five five two. Can't put my hat behind my back. Is this him? Yes, this is his ID, his tag, and all those things. Okay. Is this can be activated? No. How do you turn it off? Zero five 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 seven, please. Bro, that's enough. I'm not touching the chair, man. I'm not touching it. Thirty five hundred for something like that. Three yards up in the air now. Is the one who? That could take up a team. Two one two three zero five five seven, please. No se enchufa o no la carga. A spit mask. This is kind of fucked. I mean, dude, you fucking spit at her, right? I mean, oh, spit, he spit at someone. Oh no, dude, I just spoil it for myself. I just spoil it for myself, dude. I'll take a fifteen. I just don't know what that is. A spit mask. I just spoil it because they're talking about a spit mask. They're talking about a spit mask, dude. Okay, so can you start AMR reference transport? The person's disabled in a mobility chair. Yes, sir. How do you turn it off, man? I just turn it off, man. The chair's off. Right there? The switch is off. The chair's off and the screen's off. You're on a buzzing away. AMR routine or on a three? Does one be a pig? Let's go. Uh, we're gonna work on that, getting it over there. <laughs> he has to go in a stretcher, dude. <laughs> they have to put him in a little stretcher to get him in. <laughs> oh dear. So, well, I don't need him twice. You guys will do it. Well, at this point, you're gonna go onto there. And we're gonna take the wheelchair with us. That's with some other type of transport. So right is now that, you're going on there. Yeah, is that? Yeah, I'm just asking. You know, I'm just wondering. Yeah. First time I've been arrested. Public parking seven. Three. Yeah, because the wheelchair doesn't fit in any of our cars or anything. And you guys don't have like a correctional. Uh, corrections uh, doesn't have it. So we're gonna take your wheelchair to there. I've seen public transport. Bro, look at this mask he's got on. He has to wear the spit mask. <laughs> That's so funny. He muzzled. Muzzling a disabled Hispanic minority. Police brutality strikes again. I called them, but then you told us specifically you need that chair. So they don't have that chair over there. Bro, is what... Obviously, yeah. Like, your little plush chair. You're probably not going to be able to fucking facilitate having that straight away at the police station or whatever. God, disabled people are so fucking entitled sometimes. Jesus. That's what I'm saying. There's no van for the correctional. Well, don't forget, Brian, that the vans, they, they don't pick up off the street either. They don't do the work. We're not part of the same department. We're corrections department and we're Miami-Dade Police Department. So, you guys are going to take this chair on that left then? Yeah, we're going to take this chair on that left. Most likely, or we're going to see if there's another route we're getting to the police station. Yeah, we're going to take this chair on that left. Most likely, or we're going to see if there's another route we're getting to the police station. Somebody to see if we can But it's going. You're not going yet. You're going to sit in there until we're done with this. Well, I mean, my back is going to hurt being laying down all the time. So that's what I'm saying. I would rather... I can't, I can't stretch my legs. So I would rather until we're ready to go. I can't stretch. Um. Okay, dude. I can't stretch my legs. 
passport, I can stay here. I've been to Alright, okay. Thank you. Yeah. That's fine. Anybody you guys ready? mind? Hmm? You guys mind? If my lieutenants go with it, I'm going with it. Okay, that's wonderful. But how do I make money Whoa. off the oppressed people? Now, now, Chud, it's oh, or what you gonna do? Dude, this guy's but fucking based. So obnoxious, but we know why. Hey! Thank you very much for the 10 USD. Fuck me. Listen, we've had a great stream so far today. Thank you guys for your generosity. Where's the spitting bit? He did spit, didn't he? I think he's trying to claim he didn't spit, but he spits here, I think. Wow, why you... Hey, relax. Hey, relax, bro. Definitely money. Oh, is it in a bit? I love how shocked this little man is over a lack of transport for crippled convicts. America's biggest thank you. Violence and violent cripples. Very true. They give the five dollars. Hey, relax. Hey, relax, bro. Definitely, bro. We're not laughing at what the fuck. Is it there? Is that it there? Hey, relax, bro. Definitely, bro. We're not laughing at you. He does spit, doesn't he? Hey, what the f wrong with you? Why the f you lock me out of my house? We're gonna expand it to you right now. Go over there. You're laughing, a little wretched guy who's about three foot tall, stuck in a wheelchair, is freaking out, and you're laughing. I'm sure he spits somewhere here, doesn't he? We haven't been sent on the last post. I think that's another post. Take it. In my mind, we've got my quarter. No, no, no. There's a clip. I saw a clip of this guy, and he like, like that. He spits. I'm sure he does. Or did I dream it? Chill. Let me talk to you. No, sienta, señora. Señora, por favor. Not the pig. I'm not on this. I'm not on this. Yeah, it's not here because this is the spit mask is on here. But it's not, but you know, he's he's chill here. Is it not included here or something? He's he's chill here. I want to show you. Oh, dude, I watched it the other day. How can I find it? Does anyone know where it is? Oh, it's the other cop's point of view. Okay, but I can't see that here, I guess.